you know, whenever I'm fishing at the front of the boat and I'm casting like I am today, it's very important that I know exactly what's underneath me because then I can work around it. If you look at this Dragonfly 7, you can see that on one side I've got the chart. So that dot is actually my boat position, but I'm zoomed in. And this is the actual fish finder. Look at here, see like there's no weeds? And then look at the thick weeds that are coming here. So where I want my cast my crankbait is right on the edge of those weeds. So this is really important. So right now I'm not using it to try to see fish. I'm using it to try to see where the vegetation is in the rock piles that attract the fish. And then I make my casts with my crankbaits accordingly. So I normally don't cast right into the weeds because I know the fish are on the edges. So I cast off to one side and then I let my lure run along it. Same thing with rock piles. If there's a rock pile or a couple of boulders, I don't cast right to the boulders. I overcast them by about 10, 20 feet to make sure that my lure gets down to the right depth and I go beside it. And usually if there's a fish there, they'll whack it right off the bat. Very aggressive. This is one of the most important tools to have along with the electric.